The Pennsylvania legislature is considering a law that would hold parents responsible if their child bullies someone at school. First News Weekend anchor Katie Wilson investigated that issue today. She joins us live in the studio with what she found out. And the bill would hold parents responsible financially. They could face up to $500 if their child's continuously bullying. As you might expect, that's getting mixed reaction. Bullying is a major issue. It's happening throughout our country. The Pennsylvania lawmaker is taking the fight against bullying to the legislative floor. Representative Frank Burns introduced a bill he says holds students and parents accountable. It's a three-strike system. Strike one, the school informs the students' parents how it handled the bullying situation. Strike two, parents take a class on bullying and attend a conference. Strike three, parents are fined up to $500. State Representative Chris Sonato's all for it. It brings the parents, the student, and the school together. They actually are sitting down and coming up with a plan to say, hey, this is wrong, don't do this. Jennifer Kelly of Mercer County doesn't see that teamwork in the bill. The mother of two says the bill targets parents for an issue they're not fully responsible for. If you're going to find the, the parents, why aren't you finding the schools for not helping? But J.R. Sanford, a Pennsylvania father of two, doesn't see it that way. Bullying starts at the house with the parents, and the parents should be held accountable for the actions of their kids. Whether or not you believe parents are responsible for their child's bullying, Sonato says that there's a bigger purpose to this bill. When you look at school shootings, uh, you look at the kid who brought the knife into Pittsburgh and stabbed, what, 15 people last year. Uh, he claims he was bullied. Sonato hopes attacking the bullying problem could potentially save lives. To be able to try to do something that may prevent a tragedy from happening, I mean, that I think is the most important part of this. Representative Sonato says there will be a hearing on this bill in the very near future. Live in the studio, Katie Wilson, WKBN 27 First News.